happy thursday people so i'm on my way to work and i decided to do this quick vlog because as usual my alinean sisters we start the day checking in with each other and making sure we're all good so this morning we had an interesting conversation and kim as usual stirred the pot because kim is always cause beer drama in a good way in our chat so we were discussing this photo that has been circulating over the past few days with a mother taking her son to school and somebody in a car snapped the photo and somebody else probably blocked the child's face out but circulated the image of the mother because she was wearing a sharp pants and a shirt and stuff like that. The general consensus is that she was dressed inappropriately. We do not know the context. And my thing is, is that I've seen the photo on social media. I've not shared it because for me, I, I, I often think, I, I kind of think differently when I see certain things. Because I saw a mother who was interested in taking her son to school. There are many parents out there who don't care if their children go to school or not. You can ask the truancy officer sometimes. You can ask teachers sometimes. You will, you will see a child come to school once a week, once a month even sometimes. I saw a mother who was hustling to make, her, make sure her son got to school we don't know if she had a hard night we don't know if she worked a late night shift we don't know the cir circumstances surrounding the situation so i choose to i choose to try to see a positive and i think that we women tend to be really hard on each other and it's a lot of the comments on social media were really really insulting um towards the young lady the the young mother and as a woman i don't always get it right as a woman we don't always get it right and if a situation presents itself and somebody knows her they could have called her one side and said you know what you know when you're going to the school compound try to dress appropriately and we cannot always assume that people know when you see certain behaviors you have to understand that it reflects where they are in their current time at uh, the current time in their life sometimes what we see is all that the person knows is all they have been exposed to it is what they consider the norm and we gotta really stop judging people by our morals and expecting people to fall in line with no understanding that you know behavioral change takes time you gotta re-educate people and the PTA, the schools, obviously, you know, you can send home a note and say, well, this is the appropriate attire for when you're coming on the school compound. Because I've seen parents come on the school compound, especially secondary schools and some things that has got the young boy's head turned. Come on now, you really got to think about how you can affect the young minds. And, and, and to that end, communicating with teachers and communicating with the schools deep in the sauce at aol.com is not an appropriate email address to use sweet nucky at gmail.com is not the appropriate email to use for official correspondence <laughs> yeah so saying all that i just want to encourage the parents you know who are stressing over bills stressing over food stressing over rent stressing over everything but still taking the time to ensure that their kids go to school still taking the time to make sure that they foster a positive relationship with their child's teacher with the school's administrations because it is a partnership and if you can't be anything, people, be kind. Everybody has a story. You don't know it. I don't know it. We shouldn't assume when we see certain things. And if you're wondering about my hair, hair routines with a little eco-style gel. Have a wonderful day, people. God bless.